How do power roles influence sexual relationships? What are the most common myths about sexuality in people with disabilities? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Power roles influence sexual dynamics, affecting control, communication, and consent. They can lead to coercion in unequal relationships and reflect gender expectations in intimacy. Equality and respect are fundamental for healthy and consensual sexual relationships. Myths about sexuality in people with disabilities include the misconception that they lack sexual interest or capability, or that disabilities always limit options. The reality is that sexuality is diverse and can be rewarding with adaptations. Anal muscle exercises. Some people practice exercises to strengthen anal muscles, such as Kegel exercises, to improve comfort and control during anal sex. Ancient history. Sex toys have a long history dating back thousands of years. Artifacts have been found from ancient Greece and Rome that are believed to have been used for sexual stimulation. Anonymous toys. Some stores offer anonymous sex toy purchasing services, where products are shipped in discreet, unmarked packages to ensure customer privacy. Take it slow. Successful anal penetration generally requires patience, relaxation, and the gradual incorporation of elements for a positive experience. Technique. Differences. There is no correct technique for female masturbation, as each woman is unique in what they find pleasurable. Some women prefer clitoral stimulation, while others enjoy vaginal penetration or a combination of both. Teeth fetishism. Some people find sexual arousal towards teeth, either admiring the aesthetic appearance of a partner's teeth or engaging in erotic activities involving teeth. The effect of music on sex. Music can influence sexual arousal. Some people find that certain music genres, such as jazz or R and B, can create an intimate and sensual atmosphere. The effect of stress on libido. Chronic stress can negatively impact libido. The release of stress hormones can reduce sexual desire. Finding ways to manage stress, such as meditation or exercise, can help improve libido. The impact of culture on sexuality. Culture plays a significant role in shaping attitudes, beliefs, and sexual practices. What is considered acceptable or taboo in terms of sexuality can vary significantly from one culture to another. The importance of consent. Mutual consent is fundamental in any sexual activity. All parties involved must give their consent freely and consciously before engaging in any sexual activity. The importance of self-exploration. Knowing and exploring one's own body is essential for a healthy sexuality. Self-exploration can help people understand their preferences, limits, and sexual desires. The importance of sexual self-care. Sexual self-care involves making informed and responsible decisions about one's own sexuality, including the use of contraceptives, prevention of sexually transmitted diseases, sexual health care, and seeking professional help when necessary. The influence of the media. The media, including film, television, and music, can influence attitudes and beliefs about sexuality by perpetuating gender stereotypes, idealizing certain body types, and promoting specific sexual behaviors. The phenomenon of differential sexual desire. Some couples experience differences in sexual desire where one member has a higher sexual desire than the other. Managing these differences in a respectful and understanding manner is important for maintaining a healthy relationship. The role of dopamine in sex. Dopamine is a neurotransmitter that plays a key role in desire and reward. During sexual activity, the brain releases dopamine, contributing to the sensation of pleasure and reinforcing the desire for sex. The sexual response cycle. 
The sexual response cycle, which includes the phases of excitement, plateau, orgasm, and resolution, can vary in duration and experience for each individual and in different sexual contexts. Timely treatment. It is essential to seek medical treatment as soon as possible if an STD is suspected, as early diagnosis and appropriate treatment can prevent serious complications and reduce transmission to others. Toys for G-spot stimulation. Some vibrators are designed with a specific curvature to stimulate the G-spot, a highly erogenous zone on the front wall of the vagina, which can provide more intense and pleasurable orgasms. 3D printed toys. With 3D printing technology becoming increasingly accessible, some people choose to create their own custom-designed sex toys, tailored to their specific preferences and needs. Toys with mobile applications. Some sex toys come with mobile applications that allow controlling the vibration intensity or device settings via a smartphone, adding an additional layer of customization and fun. Types of anorgasmia. There are two main types of anorgasmia. Primary, in which the individual has never experienced an orgasm, and secondary, where the individual has had orgasms in the past, but no longer experiences them. People who have multiple sexual partners or engage in unprotected sex are at higher risk of contracting sexually transmitted diseases. The use of condoms is one of the most effective ways to reduce this risk. Used underwear fetishism. Some people experience sexual arousal by smelling, touching, or wearing underwear used by another person. This fetish may be related to attraction to body odor or the intimacy associated with the garment. Variability in preferences. Masturbation preferences and techniques can vary widely among women, and what works for one may not be effective for another. It's important to experiment and discover what feels best for each individual. Variable times. The duration of orgasms in men can vary widely, from a few seconds to over a minute. Shorter and less intense orgasms are also possible. Varied symptoms. STDs can present a wide range of symptoms, ranging from abnormal discharge, painful urination, genital ulcers, to more general symptoms such as fever, fatigue, and muscle pain. Variety of sensations. Experimenting with different sexual positions can provide a variety of sensations and stimulations, which can keep intimacy fresh and exciting in a long-term relationship. Variety of stimuli. Foreplay can involve a wide range of physical and emotional stimuli, ranging from gentle caresses to seductive words. For many women, emotional and mental stimulation is as important as physical stimulation. Vibrating toys. Vibrators were invented in the late 19th century as medical devices to treat female hysteria. Over time, they evolved to become widely popular sex toys for both women and men. Virtual sex in the future. As technology advances, virtual sex may become a more common form of long-distance intimacy. Virtual reality and telepresence can offer more immersive sexual experiences. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.